This is part 2 of the presentation on blinding learning environment and this part is going to be devoted to the benefits of such a learning environment. These days, we ask a lot from our teachers. Differentiating learning, accommodating various learning styles, teaching 21st century skills such as collaboration and digital literacy, and of course the usual, great papers, create lesson plans, make copies, etc, etc. This can feel extremely overwhelming and leaving us wondering how we can meet successfully those requirements since there is one constant constraint, time. We cannot expand the school day infinitely. Plus, our students have changed as well. Ask students the questions these days and their first instinct will be to Google it. This immediate access to information has profoundly changed the teacher's role. We used to be the main provider of information lectionering and monopolizing the center stage with our knowledge. However, such a model has outlived its age. Even the whiteboard standing at the center stage of the learning environment has almost outlived its abilities. Students are growing up in a world where they can access data anywhere, anytime, and even better, themselves control the amount of data that is being delivered to them. The whiteboard with its one-size-fits-all model cannot successfully reach today's generation. After all, in more and more living rooms in America, the TV does not stand at the center stage of entertainment anymore and has been replaced by personal devices. So, what do we do now? How do we accommodate those 21st century students while meeting all those expectations? Well, I believe that the blended learning environment can be part of the solution. So let's have a look at those benefits of such a learning environment and how it can help us meet those challenges. Challenge number one, time. The blending learning environment with its online component saves time. No more time spent copying, stapling, hole punching documents. Just upload them directly in the cloud and make them available online for your students anywhere, anytime. Also, with the flipped classroom component of the blended learning environment, instead of spending class time lecturing, you can have students watch your presentation at home and then spend that class time for classroom discussions and higher thinking activities. So yes, you not only save time, but you gain time. And with that gain of time, you can finally meet some of the requirements expected from the teacher, as well as offering a learning environment more suited to the 21st century students. With the online component of the blended learning environment, you can not only upload your presentation online, but you can also add multimedia assets to it, such as pictures, videos, to satisfy the various learning styles of your students. They can now pause and rewind the lecture for taking notes on that presentation. Even better, if you have your students watch your presentation in class, you not only clone yourself many times, but you also free yourself up for helping individual students who might require more attention and may have more questions. So you can finally meet the requirement of differential instruction and satisfy as well the new learning styles of our 21st century students. So not only you have more time for classroom discussions, but you can also change the nature of them. In the past, Classroom discussions sometimes led to a few students monopolizing the discussion while the rest of the class sit back. With a combination of online and face-to-face -face time, students who can be shy in the traditional classroom setting might feel more comfortable participating in online forums and discussion. And you increase as well your one-to-one -one interaction with your students since they can ask you questions in person or online. So not only the blending learning environment favors a student-centered approach, but it also makes a paradox possible to promote individual approach while favoring group work. For example, with cloud-based apps, students can collaborate in real time, but also asynchronous, working from anywhere within the school, but also across the globe, fostering exchanges beyond cultures and countries. So, to summarize the benefits of the blended learning environment, 
With this unique combination of face-to-face -face and online learning, you naturally save and gain time to promote student-centered instructions, but also favor deficient instructions and accommodate the new learning styles of our 21st century students. And finally, you can promote collaboration. Last but not least, it allows you to create a community of learners who have an easier access and control to class materials, but also to each other beyond the school day, and finally, to the teacher. This concludes the presentation on some of the benefits of the blended learning environment. Please feel free to check my YouTube channel or my blog for more videos on blended learning environment, but as well lesson plans on how to teach in a such a learning environment. Thank you, au revoir.